Alright, Foggers, get ready to fly. Welcome back to the WWE 2K16 AJ Styles My Career Mode. This is episode 6 here. Uh, we'll get to interfere on a Taylor Breeze match. It looks like we're in a heated rivalry with him. He's been kicking our ass for like the past couple of weeks, so we need to get some revenge. I actually had some trouble recording this episode. Earlier in the night, we took on KO Kevin Owens in an epic match. Four and a half star match. Sadly, he was victorious. We hit two Styles clashes and we could not get the job done. Uh, perhaps next time if we ever meet him in a rematch we'll just have to hit three styles clashes and hopefully that'll do the job so I didn't get to show you that but we're going to get to see Taylor Breeze taking on a Shavier Woods here I can skip it I can spectate it so I'm not really bored I think I might just skip it also before this uh, episode started I uh, adjusted some of the movesets so AJ Styles will have you know, the moves that he uses in real life, including the Styles Clash, because up until now I didn't have it. So yeah, I'm not really interested in seeing this match, so we'll skip it, and if there's going to be a cutscene or something after, then fair enough, we'll go ahead and do that. So yeah, sorry once again for not having the, the Kevin Owens match to show you, but it was an epic match, easily the best match I've had in WWE 2K16. I kicked out all his manoeuvres, he kicked out all my manoeuvres, but in the end, he, he made the tap out. And here we are, it's AJ Styles, he's on the apron, he's on the apron, he's on the fucking out here, the entrance ramp. Taylor Breeze wants something to come down, and are we going to accept? Are we going to have another brawl with Taylor Breeze? Is Taylor Breeze going to beat us for the fourth time in a row? Surely not, now we've got a picture of John Cena's steroid arms. And what's happening here? Is it me against Taylor Breeze once again? I hope it is. I just hope I don't lose them. No, we're not. So it was just a stare down, it looks like. It looks like if Taylor Breeze was successful there against Xavier Woods. So. Oh, and it looks as if we're debuting on Superstars. And we're against Taylor Breeze. Also, I forgot to mention after that loss to Kevin Owens, we did move up in the rankings above Taylor Breeze, so he's not going to be happy about that. But fuck Taylor Breeze, we don't give a shit about him. We've got him this week on Super Source, and hopefully we can finally get a win over Taylor Breeze. And I don't know if that will end the feud, but we can't lose. Not again, guys. Surely not. To be defeated four times in a row to this wee faggot, I mean, it's just not possible. Surely it's not going to happen. AJ Styles can't let it happen. Son of Scotland 90 can't let it happen. You, the subscribers and the viewers, cannot let this happen. Surely not. And if it does happen, then we just need Vincent Kennedy McMahon to come out and change it because we cannot lose to this guy in pink. And now we've got the match underway, and I'm just wasting no time here. I'm going to go straight for Tyler Breeze. Not going to give him any chances here. I'm just going to kick his ass. Went for the drop kick, Taylor Breezel with a reversal and a Hurricane Rana. And already it's 9.1 percentage in his bar. Like, what the fuck? Taylor Breeze now dragging us to her feet. What's he looking for here? Going for a suplex. No, we blocked it. And AJ Styles with the reversal. Nails the suplex of his own. But there's a flying forearm for Taylor Breeze. And Taylor Breeze now just choking out AJ. This is war, this is personal. Into the corner, both Taylor Breeze, AJ now. The punches and stomps and kicks and more punches. And he went for the clothesline but he missed it. And a big club and blow to the gut there sends AJ down now. Taylor Breeze lifting us up here to her feet. And a Russian leg sweep there on Styles. Taylor Breeze surely must be wondering how the hell can someone who's defeated three times in a row be ranked above him in the NXT Championship rankings. Taylor Breeze not happy with that and he's going to Look to beat us here for our fourth time, and surely if he does do that, then he will leapfrog us again. There's no way we can stay above him. Taylor Breeze spinning around 20 times there, and then nailing the neck breaker. Now he's dragging our body, and it's, I think we're in trouble. Look, Taylor Breeze looks like he could be closing in on victory here. It's all Taylor Breeze at the moment. He's going for the cover. 
AJ there kicking out too early. I don't think you're going to get the job done with a maneuver like Taylor Breeze with that Irish whip into the corner. AJ though with the counter. Big right hands here from Styles. And there's a running knee in the Bulldog. It's vintage CM Punk, as Michael Cole would say. And who the fuck says vintage anyway? AJ now onto the middle rope, waiting for Taylor Breeze to get up. Taylor Breeze face first down on the mat at the moment, not getting up. It's AJ Styles with the ref oh my god, refers Munsell into the DDT there. Quality maneuver there from the phenomenal one. AJ now ducks under and leaves a flying forearm. And we don't even have the ability to climb the rope. How shit is that? AJ Styles drop kick out behind, sends Taylor Breeze down. Face first again on the mat. AJ to the middle rope. A rolling sent on off the middle rope onto Breeze. Now drag them into the middle of the ring. With a dragon suplex, and I could maybe do it here. Let's go for the cover with hooking the leg. No, just getting a one count there. Not enough to put Taylor away as of yet and stomp to the back. Taylor Breeze off the snap there. Just grabbing a reverse chin lock here on Styles. Going for the cover once again, but surely that's not going to do it. Even though I'm, sh I'm shit at the kick out, it's like, but that's not going to beat me, surely not. AJ though, Russian leg sweep on Taylor Breeze, and the end here could be near AJ looking for the Brain Buster. And we know what he likes to follow up after that. Could it be Styles Clash time? AJ begging for Taylor Breeze to go up. Can we finally get a win over Taylor Breeze? We're going to kick to the midsection, lift them up, bring them down for the Styles Clash, and surely here we're going to do it. Roll them over, hook the leg. And Taylor Breeze somehow kicked, and AJ can't believe it, and I can't believe it either. I just don't think we can beat, we're not capable of beating this man. That's a backbreaker now. Speaking of Tyler Breeze's beauty shot, we've seen it flatten some big names so far, including Taylor Breeze. Shoulder block sends us down. Taylor Breeze now is going to try and end the match here on his own. Goes for the super kick, he nails it, and that almost took our head off. Taylor Breeze going for the cover, but AJ kicking out, showing a bit of resilience. Now it's Taylor Breeze, who's beyond belief here that AJ managed to kick out of that. In. But he nails the spinning wheel kick. I do not think AJ is going to kick out this time. And he does. AJ kick it out again somehow. Taylor Breeze. Is, he's shocked, man. Not even getting a one count. AJ Styles now just. Trying to get back in this thing. Nails a scoop slam there on Taylor. Taylor with the reversal. Now just having those clenched fists raining down on the head of AJ Styles. Referee needs to get in there, needs to stop that. The Breezy is in trouble, AJ going to the middle rope. He nails the roll and sent on again and that could do it this time surely. AJ hooking the leg into the cover quickly. And Breeze kicking out again. AJ, the low drop kick. And he nails the Pele. The Pele there from AJ Styles, and surely that could do it. And Taylor Breeze kicking out again. Holy fuck, I do not. AJ is shocked. He is stunned. He puts his arm on his shoulders. He can't believe it. None of us can believe it here. AJ once again with the drop kick. Irish whip into the corner. So 
AJ now tired he, he's put rests the lifeless body of Tyler Breeze here on the top rope what has he got in store here big chop now AJ going to the top here holy shit that is reverse senton AJ into the cover why did he release it I don't fucking know and Tyler Breeze once again kicking out Surely, this time, AJ Styles looking for the Brain Buster. Again, and he nails it. And now, can he find the Styles Clash for the second time? AJ Styles looking to nail it on Tyler Breeze. He does nail it. It took two, and we couldn't put away Kevin Owens, but will two Styles Clashes put away Tyler Breeze? We hook the leg on Superstars for a win for the first time over Breeze. And we've got it with the freak out. AJ Styles is victorious. Finally, we've defeated our nemesis, Tyler Breeze. It was a hard fought victory, but we've done it in the end on our Superstars debut. And there we get a four star, amazing match. more popularity points more skill points and we might just go ahead here and use them or I might use them in the next episode it doesn't really matter but finally we get a win over Tyler Breeze and hopefully now that Tyler Breeze curse has been lifted and maybe we'll kick his ass now on a regular basis that win should be enough to keep us above him in the NXT title rankings well, we're eighth before that match we might even move up now with the win who knows we're going to find out Yes, we have our ranks increased. And we're now up to 7th. Tyler Breezo has also moved up. He's moved up to 8th. Aiden and English moving down alongside with his teammate, Simon Gotch. So, well, yeah, we're getting up there pretty quickly, guys. We're in 7th now. And uh, obviously, Kevin Owens, he's the number one ranked guy. Sami Zayn in 2nd. Finn Balor is the champion. And that's what we want to be. And that's what we will be, guys. So, you know, tune in to the next episode to find out if we can get one step closer to becoming an NXT champion. Like and subscribe. And until next time, peace.